You've seen the ads, but is getting an insurance estimate by snapping a cell phone picture really a good idea? Well, this grandmother and granddaughter did just that, and now they've got a warning for others who end up in a car crash. The commercials make it seem so simple. With Liberty Mutual, all I needed to do to get an estimate was snap a photo of the damage and voila. Voila. <laughs> If you get into a car accident, insurance companies encourage customers to send pictures of the damage, and they'll give you an estimate, so you don't have to spend your day in a body shop. Hold it, hold it, boys. There's supposed to be three of you. Where's your brother? Lots of insurance companies are doing it. So how do photo estimates work? Well, you take out your phone, and then take a picture of the damage and send it into the insurance company. Shortly, you'll receive an estimate and a check. Sound good, right? Well, not according to the body shop owners I spoke with across the country. They're cheating and undervaluing, understating the actual damages on these cars. Robert Jesperger, the, the owner of Mid-Island Collision in Long Island, New York, says he's constantly battling insurance companies over what he calls lowball photo estimates. But if Is that what all state told us on? An Inside Edition producer was there when he was arguing with an all-state adjuster over an estimate. You would write a car in this matter to cheat this consumer. He points to the case of 85-year-old Muriel Agostini. Her car was hit over the driver's side wheel. She was told by her company, Allstate, to take a picture. Her granddaughter, Nicole, helped out. The first estimate we got was so low. And, like how much? Uh, it was about 1700 When the body shop owner saw the damage, he said it couldn't be fixed for so little and pushed Allstate to pay much more, $11,667. What's going through your brain when you heard that? Um, we were we were livid. Body shops say insurance companies know many customers will just cash that photo estimate check and never realize they could be owed thousands of dollars more. Many people will just deposit the checks. You have safety reasons, liability reasons that these cars shouldn't be looked at in the way that they're being looked at. Shop owners say some cars are so damaged they should have been taken off the road and totaled, like this car owned by Dennis McCorkle. His photo estimate, $1,290 from Allstate. Less than an hour later, she said, the estimate's been emailed to you and the check's already in the mail. That fast? The check's been cut. Within an hour? Yes. Then he brought his car to Dunder's Auto Body Shop in Lakeland, Florida. The owner of the body shop looked at the car and laughed at at their estimate. He laughed. He laughed. The body shop owner, Ray Gunder, told Dennis his car was unsafe and should be totaled. Allstate eventually agreed and paid $7,396, well above that initial $1,290 photo estimate. So how many times have you seen a photo estimate be underpaid? Every time. Every time. I sat down with Michael Berry from the Insurance Information Institute, a trade association. The estimate is very comparable to what an in-person adjuster. Now, I know you've talked to people who no, challenge that. that is I know not, you've that's not what we found. I know in that. case after case after case mm -hmm. after case, the check that the consumer is receiving is far below the actual damage done mm -hmm. to this car. And in some cases, people are driving dangerous cars. I would, I would challenge your premise because auto insurers want to return safe vehicles to the roadways because they continue to insure the vehicle and its occupants. But these customers are in agreement and have this advice. Avoid a photo estimate. Instead, bring your car to the shop and get an estimate by a professional who sees your car in person. Insurance companies say their top priority is to assure the cars are fully and safely repaired, and they insist the photo estimates offer flexibility and convenience to save their customers time when getting an estimate. They also say they work with body shops to pay any additional damage that's covered.